In the consultant editor of the Daily Mail, Andrew Pearce, and the associate editor of the Daily Mirror, Kevin Maguire, who has returned. Andrew has returned from Greece, and a deal Sadly. has been done. <laughs> Yeah, but not a very good deal. Uh, I think for once we can't blame Tory boy for oh. this, but Ale Alexis Cyprus, uh, who last week looked as if he'd uh, pulled a, you know, played a blinder with the uh, referendum win to strengthen his hand, is swallowed the most humiliating terms for Greece being likened to an occupation, a defeat, uh, including given uh, given uh, assets over to a fund. Uh, so it is absolutely terrible, and of course the independents say he's going to have trouble getting it through Parliament. Well, of course he will with his party. It's a very radical left party, offered a lot of hope uh, for Greece. But because they want to stay in the Euro, they've mm. had to swallow austerity. And so the big question, can you fight austerity and stay in the Euro? Well, the answer looks like no. Uh, it's can I just say, yeah. for six months since this drama has been unfolding, I've said, get out of the Euro. He said, no, no, they should stay in the Euro. It has been, this Euro is driving this country deeper nope. and deeper into recession. They've got 26% unemployment. This drama that's been played out for months and months has played havoc with the Greek tourist industry. I have just come back from there. Hotels were telling me that they were getting cancellations daily because the banks are closed. People were worried if they wander around with lots of euros in the pocket, they might get mugged and, uh, and people are worried about civil unrest. And I suspect there will be civil unrest if this ridiculous package goes through. They should have come out of the Euro. Hey, they should never have gone in the Euro. They should never have been allowed to go in the Euro. This one size currency fits all doesn't work. And the fact is it's Ma Merkel in Germany calling all the shots. This isn't about 18 or 19 countries all working together. It's about them dancing to the tune of Germany and France. The euro will only work if it doesn't you have, work. If you, Kevin. Have, if you have solidarity work. across the area and you transfer cash. Economy's in trouble. Greek economy's in trouble. You have to transfer cash. You do not impose ever deeper austerity, which makes it worse. And their unemployment. If it was in Britain, it would be eight million here. Mm. It'd be more than four times what we have now. They've lost a quarter of the economy. People are really suffering, not getting medical supplies. And you, you've often attacked Greek and Greece and shown no uh, sympathy for for the Greeks. I've got sympathy for the Greeks. They need debts written off. There's no point just. Uh, Wouldn't they be worse? Bring, worse off, like ultimately bringing back the drachma. No, short term, of course, people's what people have got in the bank would be worse a lot less because the currency would be f massively reduced. But their tourism industry would be much cheaper. Their exports are much cheaper. Uh, and what this what the, this package also does, this austerity package, it's going to bring in a 30% tax increase for the island economies. That will drive a coaching horses again through their tourism. Yeah, well, you're just worried they about paying more. Uh, for your gin and tonic. They are completely yeah. nuts and they don't care about the Greeks, they just care about the vanity of this ludicrous political Lorna. project, which is a single currency, Lorna. which he still supports. Lorna, the, the answer is if they did come out of the euro and they reintroduced the drachma, yes, it could be a lot worse early on. There's no guarantee. Short term. No, no guarantee in the longer longer run it will, be, be, bad it will be any better. Yes, it could be. Nah. I mean, that's the problem. But they want to stay within the euro because they want to remain part of mainstream. Europe, and of course you've got to remember it's it's only what 40 years ago they were run by colonels and was no democracy. Yeah. So that's you know they don't want to go back to there. They're now run by but, a German colonel but, called Colonel Merkel. But it even rhymes. Oh, God, blimey, you're going to be playing a Nazi card next, aren't you? Uh, but they but Greece has been treated appallingly, and this this will around Europe, people will think, hang on, there's a huge democratic deficit here. Yeah. It's not working yeah. for people. It has terrible ramifications for Britain. Now, yeah. I'm, I'm likely to vote yes to stay in when you we have sure? a referendum here. You sure? But there's, no this. There's, no, there's no doubt what's happening to, to Greece will strengthen the uh, hand of the no-camp in Britain. Okay. Here.